Hello everybody, it's me, Boogie. Welcome back to another video. I hope you're all doing good and fine. As many of you guys know, in Chapter 5, Season 2, it's super hard to rank up. If you don't believe me, just believe yourself. Yes, you've been playing this season non-stop trying to get that sweet unreal next to your name. Whether it's done by little Jimmy building his 5 story mansion or some crackhead using the Zeus mythic trying to evict you from your little one by one, I know, it's tough. That's why you're here to look that's why you're here to look for small loopholes to get to unreal fast so in this video i will be showing you guys the best tips and tricks that could help you boys get to unreal by end of this week but before we start i just wanted to say thank you all so much for the recent support we just hit 1000 subscribers but we cannot stop there we need to keep raising the boogie army so we have to hit 2k by end of the month so make sure to drop a like on this video and subscribe to the channel for more tips and tricks to getting out of any rank in Fortnite Chapter 5 Season 2. The first thing I wanted to talk about is fighting. Many of you are not ranking up to an optimal rank like Elite, Champion or Unreal because you do not know how to properly fight your off spawns and mid, mid games. This is a big issue because the Fortnite rank system is designed to get you the most points from the start of the game to the middle of the game. So winning your off spawns could be the difference between you ranking up to 2% or losing 5% just in one game. Every offspawn fight, you must train harder than Jake Paul trying to beat Mike Tyson. I know, it sounds crazy, but it's the truth. Winning every offspawn fight requires three main aspects. Knowing where to land, getting the best drop, and landing first to grab all the good weapons and heals. If you already did not know where to land, it is truly important, especially in the current meta. I have made a separate video on one of the best spots currently in the game. It will be in the description below. Getting the best drop. Guys, listen. Fortnite is a battle royale, so it requires you know you to know how to get the best job for your job spot. It doesn't matter what kind of player you are, you could be Mr. Savage or even Mongrel, but if you don't know how to get the best job spot for your for the spot that you are going to, you will lose every off spawn fight. It is truly important to fully understand these aspects because when you apply these into a real game, you will see progress almost instantly. Landing first to grab all the good weapons and heals. Guys, I cannot stress this enough. I have seen so many of my friends die at the start of the game because they do not know how to land first and get the best weapons and loot. The best way to practice this, this is by playing pubs. I know, I might sound like Cypher PK right now, but if you're not a good player and love to play passive, then I recommend going into a solo game with ranked off and practicing your landing spot. This is a great this is great in many ways, first of which being you should you would get practice without having to worry about losing those precious points you gathered up all season. Another being that you would get that game sense that you may lack. If you don't know what game sense is, brace, I'm only doing this once. Game sense is the ability to read the game, anticipate the movement of opponents and make smart decisions in split seconds. Alright. Now that you know what game sense is, it is important to master it fully and understand it completely. If you don't, then get comfortable with the loading screen and the main lobby. Another important tip I wanted to let you guys know is mechanics. Yes, this, this might be the point where you skip off to go watch your little YouTube shorts. But hear me out, having the basic mechanics could be the difference between winning every game and losing every game. To fully understand mechanics, I'm gonna put it into simple words. Mechanics are about how you execute the fundamental actions in game. The best way I have found out to truly and effectively train your mechanics is playing the game smartly. Many of you, many of you open Fortnite, you go straight into a ranked game and die which in result gets you irritated and you learn nothing. So when you open Fortnite next time, I recommend going into the Raiders mechanic training map V4 which I'll have in the description below. This map includes everything from aim training, peace control and even angles training. I want you guys to spend at least 30 to 40 minutes a day practicing this map. Trust me, this map helps. This map have helped me go from a noob on keyboard and mouse to an actual decent player. I've transferred all my skills from controller, like my mechanics, my editing, my game sense, my everything. I've transferred them all to keyboard and mouse 
through this map i still have much to learn on keyboard and mouse but i'm hoping this map can help me and you which i'm not even hoping i know all right guys that's all i had to say about how to rank up the easiest and the most efficient way possible i understand if many of these tips and tricks i provided does not make sense so i encourage you guys to leave a comment addressing what the problem is that you are having i respond to everyone so don't be afraid with that being said we are on our way to 2000 subscribers by end of the month it would mean a world to me if you guys could take three seconds to drop a like on this video and subscribe to the channel so we can hit that milestone by end of the uh, set time i hope you guys enjoyed the video until the next one stay safe and cozy Later.